We're running out of games now in the Premier League with just six games to go to keep Swansea in the Premier League. We've got tricky away tie at the Hawthorns to play West Brom, followed by a home game against Everton. Siggy returns to the Liberty. Can we show him it was a mistake to leave the Swans? Find out today. What's happening guys, my name is Adam, I am a Super Swan and welcome back to the Save and Swan series. Today we've got some games coming up, we've got West Brom away from home at the Hawthorns, we've also got a game at home to Everton. So Siggy's coming back to Swans, hopefully we can pick up a result. So we've arrived just before the West Brom game, our tactics are going to be the usual players. I think as far as our first team goes, these are locked in, I don't think we've got anybody really challenging for first team places other than the people we have. Borja Lasso is the only one I would maybe put on the wing for De Fue, which next season he probably will take over that role, but he's on loan till the end of the season, De Fue, so I'm not going to waste him away on the bench. If he's here, we're going to use him. Uh, so Fabianski in goal, he's coming back from injury. Uh, young Mawson Bartley, Rika at the back. Britain retains his holding midfielder position. Mesa Sanchez in the centre of mid. Stuani on the right. De La Fue on the left. And Jordan Ayew up front. So, as we are... Let me just make sure I take a screenshot so we do not lose the league table. Uh, yeah, we're, we're in 15th place. It's very close at the moment. You know, a win could take us up to mid-table, depending on other results. So, we are away. I'll take a draw away from home, to be honest with you. I know we're getting a lot of nil-nils recently, but I'll take it, do you know what I mean? I'd rather take a nil-nil than a loss. So let's kick off. West Brom, where are they? They're above us in the table, they're 13th. Only a point ahead of us in the table, though. So anybody's game, do you know what I mean? It can be anyone's game. Playing in red, so I'm wearing the correct attire for the game. Even though it's not a Swansea shirt, it's a Wales shirt, but, you know, same thing. Same thing. So, open 15 minutes, not a lot to write home about, really. So, that's going to go to Leon Britton. De La Fue, cut inside. He's going right through the middle. Takes an absolutely terrible shot. He hasn't... He hasn't done a lot as De La Fue. And West Brom scored! Just like that. I thought the highlight would be a little bit longer than that. Give me a chance to tell my De La Fue story. But no, no, they'll just give us, you know, we'll just score. Why not? Bit of a scrappy one, to be honest with you. So, West Brom seem to be having the most shots, but they are at home. So, it is to be expected. Oh, Kyle Bartley. Unlucky from a corner. Mesa's going to take one from the right-hand side. And Charlie's going to clear. Sanchez up to AU. Kyle Bartley, the centre-back, and that's the end of the highlight. So we've had six shots, none on target, four of them being long shots. Jordan Ayew, that's Stuani, and that's one all. Get in there, boys, we're back in the game. Stuani, the goal scorer. So we hit back quite quick. I think we needed that, to be honest with you. We needed to get a goal. So Rika on the left, plays in De La Fue, who plays in Jordan Ayew. See Stuani making the run, and it's a nice finish in the bottom corner. So we're coming back into the game. I don't want to change anything up yet. There's nothing I need to shout. You know, we're doing all right. It's picking up points is the main thing. Mesa plays it to Delafue on the left. Delafue with a run. Delafue, stop being so selfish. Pass the ball. You have teammates. Use them. Instead of having to run around the whole team and score. You're not in school anymore, De Fue. You can use your teammates. So it's one all. I mean, we've had a majority of the shots. Only two on target, though. So not too bad there. Uh, as far as tactics go... You know, I'm going to keep the same. There's nothing I really want to... Maybe go flexible. Which won't make that much of a difference, but... It'll at least bring... As far as I understand the actual team shape, or however it's named, it's how strictly like the defenders and the midfielders play in their positions. I could be wrong, but that's how I interpret it anyway. 
So 60 minutes in, I think we need to make some sort of sub. Uh, as far as the team shape goes, I'm alright with that. I mean, if we were at home, I might go more attacking, but I'd rather take the point than lose by going attacking. I'm going to bring Delafoy off. He's been a bit shit today. Borja Lasso can come on. See if he can make the difference. Seeing as Delafoy is on loan. I was, as I was explaining before, he's not really lit it up as well as I'd hoped. He had that one game which was off camera, which was amazing. But... I'm going to demand more. See if we can get ourselves a goal. And as I say that, Jordan Ayew is injured. Good thing we have one Wilfred Boney. So we are going to mix things up a little bit. We're going to change the way we play. Have a half in a target, man. I'm okay on counter. I'm okay on flexible. Nothing really I need to swap. I'm, all, I'm okay with this tactic. It's working for us. Oh. West Brom should have scored that, to be fair. It'd be nice to get a win. So, 83 minutes. I think we're going to try and see if we can go for a win. I know that contradicts everything I've just said. However, we're going to go for it. So, we're going to move Borja Lasso into the middle. Can anybody play on the left? Tammy, can you play on the left? You can. Can Stuani play on the left? He can play on the left as well, as an inside forward. So, what I might do... Uh, we'll keep them there. We'll keep them there. So we're going to go more attacking. See if we can get ourselves a win. Could be a mistake. It could be a mistake. But it looks like it's going to be a draw, though, to be honest with you. Yeah, this is going to be a draw. But that's fine. I'll take a one all away from home. I'll take a one all away from home. We're not losing games. So that's full time. So it's a one all draw at the Hawthorns. So, you know, I, I'll take a draw. If somebody said, if you told me before the game we get a draw, that's no problem. So Jordan A is up for 11 days. So that's going to put him out. It'll definitely put him out for the Everton game. Possibly the Man City game as well. But what we'll do, as far as the table goes, we're 15th place, so I don't think we move position. We've got to look down, so that puts us now four points off the relegation zone with, well, Huddersfield haven't played yet, so potentially four games off the relegation zone, uh, four points, sorry. If they win, they'll go on to 31 points, so we're still two points clear if Huddersfield win their game. So what we'll do is we've got Everton next, which is in a week's time, we'll come back for the Everton game. So I thought I'd come back for this little tidbit here because... I'm used to seeing these sort of screens where the news reports say, oh, there's so many teams up for relegation or up for the title or up for Champions League places. I have never seen this many teams <laughs> fighting for something. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten teams apparently the media think could go down. Which realistically, you know, there's only five points separating 18th to 11th. That is how close this table is. I can't think of any game of football manager play where it's been this close. So, I mean, a win for Crystal Palace puts them up to 13th. Obviously, barring goal difference. It's mental. That's absolutely mental. So, it's more important than ever to start picking up points. So, we'll go over to the Everton game. We'll talk tactics. So, here we are, the tactics page for the Everton game. As you can see, we're going to go attacking. We're going to go for the win. We're going to go for the three points because if we can get three points, it really, with how we just seen with the table, it's going to put us in a better position to stay up this season. A few changes here. Norton's going to come in and right back. Uh, my assistant thinks that Young is now the best of games, so I'm going to believe him. We're going to trust our assistant. We're going to go for Norton right back. Defense is pretty much the same. Uh, obviously, because of our new attack formation, Sanchez is now going to be a box winner midfielder. Borja Lasso comes in, so as our attacking midfielder, and due to the injury to Jordan Ayew, who is fit, but he's struggling a bit, so we're going to bring in Boney to play up front. So we're going to go, hopefully, see a lot more attacking from our team. Prove a point. A win today will certainly put the cat amongst the pigeons, and that's not something I thought I would ever say in a Swansea video. 
So let's get this thing underway. Let's see if our new tactic shows any dividends. You know, well, shows that intent, intent to win the game. Or are we just going to get absolutely battered by Everton? Who, realistically speaking, are a better team than us on paper. But points are not decided on paper. So Norton's going to get to Stuani. Borja Lasso in the middle. He sees Stuani making the run. That's a penalty. That is a penalty. It's Ten minutes in. We've got a brilliant chance to take the lead. And we take advantage. Stuani with the penalty. And we score from the spot. And that puts us, if the league will table will update, I believe I read it said 12th. That's a nice penalty. Up of the... Into the upper part of the net on the left-hand side. I would like to see the league table, please, game. If you'd like to provide me a highlight to see the table. Which, to be honest, I'll take a 1-0 and run. So we're getting a lot of shots in. There we are. Look at that, 13th in the table. Because if we started at 20th, that's not bad. Although I'm not going to speak too soon because Everton look like they're on the attack. Although Mawson cut it out. Stuani on the right, oh, he's easily dispossessed by Lincoln Baines. Siggy, shouldn't have left Swansea, Siggy. Shouldn't have left Swansea. Look, Everton, you're only on the same points as us, Siggy. What's the point? Sanchez gets that out to Delafu, eh? To Boney. Again, easily dispossessed. That's going to be Bartley, surely. Plays it back to Fabianski. Now calm down, boys. Calm down. Just don't do anything stupid. Like that, Bartley. Like that. That's what I'm talking about, being stupid. Rika tackles the ball. Oh, and it had to be him. It had to be him. A, I say don't do anything stupid. B, Sigurdsson scores. That, how many mistakes were in there? Bartley makes a mistake, which gets Morales the ball. Rika makes the slide, and Nort it's Norton. Norton just doesn't go for the ball. He just watches Siggy go past him. It had to be, Siggy, of all the players. So stupid mistakes cost us a goal. But can we equalise straight away? Mawson to Rocky Mesa. Mawson again. That's going to go to Sanchez. See if we can recycle the ball. De La Fue. Oh, that's a good tackle. That's a good tackle. And it's Route 1 stuff. Bartley, don't do anything stupid, for God's sake. Between Bartley and Norton, they are not in my good books right now. After that goal. Rico wasn't the best man for making the slide, but he, it's something he had to do. So that's going to go Niasi. Oof, that's over the bar. That's not troubling Fabianski. But we need to pick up a win. Because I, I, on camera, I think we haven't had a win in about five, four or five games. So those two wins we had off camera have done amazing for us. But it's half time. I mean, Everton have certainly come back into the game. We started off well. We got the goal. We owe Everton after what happened our last match. Go out there and get revenge. Revenge, I tell you, team. Revenge. I'm going to demand more as well. We, we need more from this game. We need a win. We definitely need a win. And the problem is I haven't really got a striker to bring on for Burnley. Well, I have Jordan Ayew, but he's injured. I don't want to risk him. But we'll see how it plays out now. So Sanchez gets it to Stuani. Borja Lasso in the middle to Mesa. Is he going to play it out wide? Yes, to Norton. Redeem yourself, Norton. Boney with the header, and it's a goal. Norton redeemed himself. Boney, the target man, gets the goal. So... I think Norton has redeemed himself. That's a good pass over to Norton. He crosses it in. Boney with the header. To be fair, maybe could have done a bit better there, the goalkeeper. But a goal's a goal. We're going to take it. Because we need a win. We need to show this league we deserve to be in the Premier League. So, right, we'll pause. We're, we're an hour in. Let's, let's have an evaluation of the tactics here. So Mesa's looking very tired. He does. He needs to be subbed. Uh, what is he? Mazella. Tom Carroll can play Mazella. Yeah, he can. As far as tactics go, 
I'm, I'm not going to change what's not broken. We're 2-1 up. Uh, the conditions looking fine. There's no nobody else I really want to sub. Maybe on 18 minutes we'll bring it back. We'll go a bit more defensive. I mean, possession's 50-50. But also a good tackle by Rika. Boney. Oh, that was a poor pass. We're just making very poor passes today. Norton with the ball. That gets to Stuani. Stuani's been a bit of a revelation on that right wing. I've got to be honest. He's done well. Good signing. Oh, they tried to FIFA goal it. They tried the pass across goal. And it didn't work. Oh, maybe I should go defensive. Because it seems like Everton's starting to come back into the game a bit. No, I don't. I think 70 minutes is too early to go defensive. So we'll hold fire. We will hold fire for now. But it's a very even game. Nine shots each, four shots on target each, three off target each. So it's, it could be anyone's. Stuani on the right. Can he find anyone in the box? Colmo with a safe header to Morales. I don't like route one. Root, I don't like those long balls. Morales again. And that's a poor shot. It's an absolute poor, poor shot. You did well, mind. Okay, we'll have another look. 77 minutes in, we'll have another look. And I'll be looking a bit tired. Anyone that could do with maybe a bit of a rest. I think now's the time to go back to our DM uh, formation. And I think Borja is a good candidate to come off. Because he is on a yellow card. Do I stay on... Yeah, we'll stay on counter. We'll stay on counter attack. Well, we were on um, control, but we'll go counter for our defensive formation. We're settling, boys. We're settling for 2-1. Should I... Oh, now that I see the highlight there, was that a mistake? Was that a mistake? I hope not. I honestly hope not. Was that a mistake? Am I going to pay for it? Oh, we're not passing like that, though. Mawson cuts it out well. All right, come on, boys. Counter-attack. Not... Again, a poor pass. Boys, you're Premier League players. You can't be passing like this. Oh, that's a penalty. I don't want to look. Fabianski. Everyone pray for Fabianski. Come on. For the win. Oh, I thought he saved it. I thought he saved it. Oh, that's going to push down 16th, according to the right up there. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. We need, we need to go for the win. So even though we've gone, we've gone, we've gone from defensive to attacking, back to defensive again. No, the other way around. We've gone from attacking to defensive to attacking. Right. Britain's only two-star at Mazzella. Carroll's only two-star at Advanced Playmaker. Is there anyone I can really bring on? Abraham, can you play attacking mid? How many times? Uh, not really. Can you play attack at midfield, Delafue? No, you can't. Not really. Do I risk on bringing Jordan A? Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I have an idea. I have an idea. We'll bring Carol Mazella. Britain can come off with Tammy Abraham. Boney can play as... An advanced playmaker. And Tammy Abraham can be a complete forward. There we go. And we're going to go attacking. We're going to go for it. We're going for it, boys. And girls. It could be, you know, it could be anybody. We're going to go for it, though. We're going to go attacking. Bony with the ball. Tammy Abraham. That's Carol! Oh, my God, Carol! You had the chance! Oh, is that going to be it? Is that going to be it? Tom Carroll, you absolute lemon. What are you doing? And again, a poor pass. All oh, we've seen this game are poor passes by this team. They can't pass a ball. God alive. If we win, oh, I hope. Oh, come on. Right, Boney. Come on. We deserve... I, I say we deserve something from this game, but I want to win. I want to win. 
I've lost that feeling of a win. I want it back. So Tammy Abraham, he's got space on the right to Stuani. To Boney, and Boney gets the goal! Get in there, boys! Right, hang on, pause. Pause! We're going back defensive again. We're going back defensive. And I've taken Britain off. Britain, I need to come back on again. Uh, right, okay. Boney go back up front. Um, can, can Carol play DM? Not really. What's your tackling like? 11. Uh, Sanchez, what's your tackling like? 12. You're slightly better. I need someone to pay DM. <laughs> I've made my subs. Um, defensive. We're just going to keep it like that. We're going to make, we're going to play like that. But everyone behind the ball. In fact, oh, that's not going to make me make changes. But let me see the goal again. Tammy Abraham sees Duane on the right, crosses it in, and Wilfred Boney. What a goal! Right, I want to make I want to make tackle changes. Right, okay. I have another idea. Delafue can come sit here. Stuani can sit here. Just play wingers. Oh, no, not attack. Go support. I don't. I, I want to. I want to stay back. Just play out for the win, boys. Oh, no, it's a corner. Oh, off the line. Off the line. And Boney's on his own up there. Waste time. Just waste time, boys. Just waste time. Sanchez. To Boney. That's it. That's it. Hold the ball up. Oh, oh that's fine. That's fine, Stuani. Take, take the foul. We've got another five seconds to go to hang on to this victory. Come on, ref. Blow up. It's about time. Boney. Come on. We'll wait. Look. Come on. 24 seconds. Come on, ref. We've had enough time now. Blow the whistle. Oh, it's a poor pass. But it doesn't matter. It's a massive win today for Swansea City. And oh, what a game. Oh. Oh. I need time to breathe. Right. Passionate. Good work out there. You did what was needed. And that was a massive win today. Steel. Narrow win. I don't care that we stole it. A win's a win. Three points are three points. Boney ends his goal drought. And what a way to end it. So where's that put us in the table? 12th place in the table. Five points off 18th. Although they do have a game in hand. So at least four points, possibly, which is kind of where we were before. But a massive win today by the boys. That could be important. That could be very important for us. So let's have a look at the schedule, for just for next time, because I think we need time to breathe here. So we've got five games of the season left. Now, I'm thinking of skipping Man City and just going straight to the Arsenal game for the semi-final. And then, depending on how, well, we'll do the semi-final and then we can have the last three over a space of two episodes. Because we are more than likely going to get stuffed by Man City. So we're going to write that game off. They're second in the league, although they should be first because the game just favours my United. So next time we're going to come back for the Arsenal game, an FA Cup semi-final game. I don't think we're going to win it, but we'll take what we can get, to be honest with you. We we wanted to save Swansea. That's the aim of this series. And it does extend not just to this season, but for next season as well. So we're not going to stop after the end of this season. We're going to carry on. We're going to try and build a legacy if we can. So we're going to come back for the Arsenal game, the FA Cup. And then we'll do the Chelsea game, I think, as well, depending on how long it is. And then the following episode, we've got the last two games of the season against Bournemouth and Stoke. So... Oh, I'm still out of breath. I wasn't even on the pitch. I'm out of breath. But thank you very much for watching this episode, guys. And just remember, we're here every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 4 o'clock. Please leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. After, especially after that Everton game. You've got to leave a like for that. That's probably the best game we've had so far on the channel. But uh, So thank you very much for watching. And I will see you next time in the FA Cup.